Okay, so I've kind of got mixed emotions about what I'm going to attempt to do tonight, you know? It's a... Uh, it's one of those things where it's probably not a good idea, but, you know, I'm being basically controlled by the sales. You scroll down. There it is. Part of Import-Export, the Armored Boxville. Yes, I still don't have an Armored Boxville. And it is radically, radically discounted. Why it's this expensive to begin with, I have no idea, because it's a very, very mediocre vehicle. I mean, there's, I already have an armored, you know, insurgent pickup. There's, you know, I have, once you have the insurgent pickup, you, you don't need this. It's, it, the, the insurgent pickup will knock stuff out of the way better. It can take explosives. This can't, I don't even think this has bulletproof tires. I really don't, I think it's really, there's not much you can do with it. But it's so cheap compared to what it normally is. 700,000 off. And I think it's like a million off the, you know, but this is, you know, so if you're going from, what was it, 2.9? This is a huge discount. So what we're going to try to do is we're going to see if we can talk somebody into helping us with the uh, with the mission on this. So, special vehicle work. Here it is. The armored bugs. So CuroServe client needs some technology in the hands of a Merriweather client. Take an armored RV to the Palmer Taylor Power Station and go get it for them. They'll be expecting you. Can we get someone to go along? Okay, now let's try that with this, the audio turned down. I mean, I always kept it turned down. So I wouldn't get, you know, copyright struck. But every time I turn the thing on now, it resets back to full volume. I don't know why they're trying to do this to me. Purchase all ammo. Wow, it's... It's a lot of ammo. So, now does anybody want to play with me? Somebody come and play. Somebody come and play today. Somebody come and shoot NPCs in a big ugly truck. It won't take long. Somebody come and play today. Okay, first of all, is that the real Leroy Jenkins? Wouldn't that be incredible? Leroy Jenkins. That'd be that'd be awesome. If I could, if Leroy Jenkins would sign up, that would you know be really even better is if somehow Leroy Jenkins signed on for this mission and then screwed it up because he just rushed in. That would be that would be the pinnacle of my YouTube career here as a video gaming YouTuber kind of guy. Probably not gonna happen. Let's do the time warp again. Dumb engineer. 6969. Wow. On call. Let's call him up. <coughs> Dumb engineer. I am an engineer, by the way, in my by my daily trade, and uh, I have a feeling he's being sarcastic. <laughs> I'm just a dumb engineer. Don't listen to me! Not like you ever do. I know that feeling where it's like you, people, you tell them stuff, and they go, well, no, I know better than the engineer does. I'm just, you know. Go to the armored box. Okay. Go and collect your modified vehicle. You're using a SecuroSurf approved upgraded box fill. If you can't shunt someone off the road with this thing, a large caliber turret will more than take care of it. Here we go. Loop de loo. Small amount of pressure. They only have one more day before the the sale goes away, and I'd really like to sell it up tonight. They'll drop me to 600k as far as my overall money uh, amounts are. It won't be good, but what's that? Okay. Man, flare this thing out. Where is it? Got me right here. I'm gonna set this down somewhat easy, easy, you know, somewhat slowly here. Easily. Not like, you know. Oh, for Mr. I thought he was gonna go right into the, uh, 
Oh, what's he gonna call us now? Where is this thing? Is he gonna drive? Okay, well then, if he wants to drive, I was—I always drive, you know. It's happy to drive. Come on. So our client and his business partner had a falling out over a dark ops transmitter at the Palmer Taylor Power Station. The client hired you. The partner hired Merriweather. Welcome to the future, people. Private security forces settling disputes for rich people and shadowy governments. Get in and get the transmitter, but look out. They know you're coming. So, here's our first taste of the armored box, though, which is not a very good vehicle overall, generally. But, sometimes the mission versions of these things are a little bit better than what's stock, so we can only hope. That things go well. I am at least, you know, in the gun position for a change, which is kind of nice. Looks like it's one of those long drive kind of things. Maybe not, maybe not. Ben here at the power station. You know, if you saw what this thing comes in. Merryweather are in control of the facility. They will shoot on sight. Well, so will we. We basically have to strength the heck out of everything here. Kill everybody who's going up to that point. You can't drive in, I gotta go in. Letting me collect what I need. to examine the container. <laughs> Tucked it right into my jammies! Okay, let's switch, switch weapons. Don't go after anybody, let's just... Bad timing. I'm changing clothes. Shit! Bend over here! Here it comes! I'll keep him busy! Ugh! So we can get him to crash. Reloading! You're gonna die! Ah! Give me your hand over here!
Oh, he's got it. Good. Good job. Good job. You're gonna have to hit H. Jesus. And again, I don't know that the armored box box wheel itself is this good at uh, ramming through stuff in free mode. If we just keep driving along here, um, maybe bird. This is on A easy. We I can't use my pistol with you things like that. If I could just drive well enough. Come on. I just want to unlock this thing. I think they're backing off. You might be in the clear. All right. Whew. That's a good thing because we never did hit H. You got clear. That's a big win for the company. Okay, so where do we have to get to? Now, we just have to make sure we get there before like, this guy disconnects or something. Come on. Pull another gear here, come on. Why would Merriweather have me use something that's this cobbled together? Alright! Mission passed, which means we should be able to get the discount. Almost a 502. I kind of enjoy being 501. You have that whole 501 blues thing going, you know? It's that was pretty intense. All right. Okay, so now what? Well, I guess we should call the vehicle. Or should we just make it mini? I'd like to get back to someplace somewhat secure to do some other things. It's a big black truck. Let's do this. Let's do this before, you know, something else happens. Check to make sure we got the price. We do. It's purchased. You may not purchase a vehicle at this point. Hey boss, your EA here. You've been looking at that Warstock site? SecuroServe are giving us trade price on the special vehicle you just used on the job. If you want one, we can keep it underground at the warehouse. 
All right, so now I can do it. And now we will do it. That was the whole point. And like I said, if you ask me objectively, is this a good idea? No, no, it's a bad idea. This is a, a very, very mediocre vehicle. Now I only have half a million dollars. Let's see, can we call it up? It hasn't been delivered yet. Fresh wheels, we got there. We can get some stuff. Let's see. What's he doing? He's driving off. Fair enough. <coughs> you know what we're gonna do? I'm gonna be ironic. I'm going to pick a vehicle that is, right now, I know, a better vehicle than the armored box of Let's have this pulled up. The Speedo Custom. Now this thing, I, I believe, is as bulletproof as the, uh, the armored box of which the armored box is not. I have direct control over the turret, which I guess must be like a psychic link or something, because you can, you know, yeah, I'm just driving the car. Let's switch to a pistol so I can drive around. I think it's faster than... Faster than... So driving back home again. We won't go there. We want to go to our actual... Uh, let's go to our special uh, vehicle cargo warehouse thingy. Now there it is. Let's cruise down. You can see all the stuff we've picked up recently. I haven't been down there because I bought some of these. Why did I buy the armored box full, really? Am I simply, you know, addicted to the deal? It was such a good deal. It's, it's like making money when you're saving money, that old kind of thing. Partially. I think it's... Alright, hey, listen. that's he, he did exactly what I needed him to, so that was cool. Thank you, dumb engineer. I'm telling you, I know, I know where he's coming from, I think, on some level. He's being sarcastic. So, we have, in, for the longest time, all I really had was the Ruiner 2000 down here. And then I got the Blazer Aqua because, you know, it's one of the th most uh, common things that you see in races. Got that one. But since there's been a lot of different sales going on, and really since, um, really, it's, it's, it's been a major thing since they've had the, the uh, the nightclub stuff where you can make so much money by idling the heck out of your computer, which hopefully isn't killing my computers. I'm not sure I'm going to do that anymore. But the, um, I think I've sorted some of that with a bunch of dust uh, off and some, uh, some reflashing of the BIOS. But I've got myself a ramp buggy. You can see I got it painted on kind of crew and chrome. Haven't done much with this one yet. I'm thinking, thinking, I'm going to paint it white. For the simple reason that that's the one, you know, when when Mythbusters, this is the original Mythbusters color, which was the dump truck, but when they redid it again with the uh, the regular truck, the regular tractor trailer, it was, it was light. Don't know if I can get the flames on the nose, though. And here we have the newest acquisition. Now, let's see something here. The question is, will this thing ram through cars like it just did? I have to admit, that was pretty good. That does ram through traffic. Pretty impressively. I was always under the impression that this did not do that. Oh, there goes a 9F. Hopefully it wasn't roughly or something. Now, the other question... I know, but I got a bump that I can't... Let's park it. Get in the back. Is it not letting me get in the back? Yeah, it's not letting me... We want to get in the back, good sir. <laughs> okay, so I can't use the gun. You have to have somebody... 
Unless someone else is driving, can't use the gun. But it does crash into things really good. All right, that it's a much better ram that can, comes on the speedo custom if you put the ram. In. All right, well I don't feel so much buyer's remorse now. It does smash into things really good and get things right the heck out of your way. Not particularly fast or rough, but not bad. It is ugly as all heck. Okay, there's one more test I'm going to do and then I'm going to... We'll call this one good. Because be right in the downtown is the place to do this. Alright, that's a downside. That's a real downside. Tires... Tires go flat. Can we modify this? So this predates, you know, the whole uh, gun run thing, so it should, if it can modify it, it should be able to modify it, and certainly, hopefully, repair it. Now, having been said, it does seem to handle pretty well for having flat tires. Whoa, what the heck? I was holding the brake and it was popping wheelies. This vehicle cannot be modified. So I can't even put bulletproofs on it. And you'll notice this thing can only be modified in X. Alright, well then there's only other one other thing we can look at here. I'm gonna park outside my apartment. <laughs> that is common. So I can Does the armor plating have any effect? Nope, you can shoot it right in the armor plating, it flattens the tires. Oh man, that's a real weakness. It's a real weakness in this game. Thing's got metal plates on the tires, doesn't protect them from bullets. Oh well. I feel like cruising out here with just to send it back. We'll take this as one of the newest editions here. The Survivor. Oh, what can I say? That's the armored box mill for you. It's um, better than I thought, but my expectations were low. And on that note, I think it just blew up my uh, crap. No, there it is. So, I don't know, maybe I'll idle it for a little while. Just get myself back up over a million. Yeah. <laughs> oh, GTA. Your addiction is a many splendid thing. This is your Black Knight. Have a great night. Oh lord, it's hard to be a completionist when everything is so expensive. <laughs>